GI drone here. Can anybody guess what's in this? Well, it's very clearly marked. High discharge light pole batteries, 3.7 volt, 350 mAh, and there's 25 afterwards. I would assume maybe 25C. I don't know. And this company's name is Noi Posi. I believe that's how you would say it. Let's see what's in the box here. I'm just going to pop this open. Bam, you have a multi charger, which will hook into USB. And then we also have individually wrapped batteries. And let's take a look at one of these batteries here. And I'm just going to pop that open. And we're going to drop that out of there. And look here. That is very clear. Again, nice writing. The Noi Posi is written off to the left. Your voltage, your MAH. We're going to go ahead and show you how these look on the charger, what to do with them on the charger, and then we're going to get some flight out of them. All right, check it out, guys. This little wire, all you have to do is just plug it into the side there, and then your wire is going to go into a USB. Computer, if you have a little thing for wall jack, you could do that. And once you have these plugged in and they need to be charged, you'll see red lights. Once these red lights go out, that means these are charged. I don't have these charging. I want to get these in the air to see if there's any type of RTF flight time on them. RTF, ready to fly. See if uh, we unbox these, we can fly right away. All right, check it out, guys. We still got these three charging. These two have not been on the charger whatsoever. And this is the Nano Prowler, and this is the Hubson X4. And that's actually what these batteries are being advertised for. But if you have this one, compatible and these are upgraded batteries for both of these so we're going to go ahead and stick one of these in there one of these in there and see what type of flight time we get rtf ready to fly right out of the box all right all right here we go guys we're going to take this out of the bag again this is a rtf test ready to fly right out of the box see if there's any type of charge on these the three that i put on the charger are still on the charger this one is still in the bag it wasn't used we're going to put this in here and we're going to get these connected i have this sped up a little bit because i had a hard time connecting it that way you didn't have to watch me struggle and bam nope there it is we have lights so we are going to get the quadcopter binded to the controller that's simply accomplished by turning on and then you throttle up make sure you're connected but just by turning on it does it and I have this sped up by times eight just for uh, just for time that way I'm not wasting your time here this is a review of the battery not so much the quadcopter and as you can see it does fly it does have a charge on it and right now we're about two minute mark here and we're kind of goofing off here back in the woods trying to fly around stuff BAM BAM and that's exactly what happens <laughs> um, we lost a propeller I doubt we're going to be able to find that in here. So we're inside now and we are going to put on a propeller. That's one of the ones the manufacturer provided. All you have to do is stick it on the nub here and then you will put significant pressure down. And once you have it on, take your two fingers and press very hard. And then your propeller should be on. We should be ready for flight. Again, the lights are still steady. I haven't shut this off. This is still on the same charge. And again, this is times eight. We were at about two minutes, maybe two and a half minutes with the last flight before we hit the ground. And uh, we're in there. Yeah, these definitely have RTF time. So that's good. If you got these and you want to fly, you're going to be able to fly. Right now, we're pushing, we were at two and a half. We're pushing about five to six minutes this got. Not bad. So we have the Nano Prowler now, which is not what this is advertised for, and we have a light on our charger. This battery is done. Within a matter of six to seven minutes, the battery is done. That tells you that these were pre-charged. They just need to be tipped off, and as you can see, another light went off. And just to show you here, we're going to stick this one back in here. If it lights up, nope. It's definitely charged the next one is definitely charged so they definitely do have some type of RTF qualities because in about six to seven minutes these two batteries are done so that's pretty cool again uncharged battery we're gonna test the RTF qualities we're gonna stick this in the nano prowler and uh, see what type of flight time we get out of this one the last one was about five to six minutes which is about average for a manufacturer's battery these are aftermarket batteries 
if we had tipped them off like it did with the two that I just unplugged there, there's a very good possibility we would, get, would have got seven to eight minutes. I will do that test on both of these. I'll take fully charged batteries, I'll take them in both of these, and we'll do a time test, and I'll let you know exactly how much time you will get out of these after you tip them off. And we are connected. You want to watch your wires on this. I'm actually going to bend them upwards, that way it's not affecting the way it sits, that way the gyro calibrates evenly. We're going to grab our controller here, we are going to turn it on, throttle up, and then down, and then lightly up again. We're ready. And right now we are outside, again I have it on times 8 just to conserve your time, because again, this was just for the Noiposi batteries. This was a review of them and this is showing you they definitely have RTF qualities. You can see me going up, you can see me going out. This is not a relaxed flight. This is actually an aggressive flight where I'm flying at a decent rate of speed. I have it in the second speed setting and we're going up, down, left, right, pretty high up in the sky and bam, definitely has it. Right now we're pushing about the five and a half minute mark and she's coming down five and a half minutes i'm jay drone i hope you enjoyed this